Hello and welcome to a tutorial on how to make a fake full diamond armor Minecraft skin in the new Minecraft 1.8 update. Right now you're looking at two skins. I've decided to make two different skins, one being a more realistic skin that has all the popping out features with it. The only thing is, this one cannot toggle because you would see the diamond armor pants and boots at the base skin layer. And then another skin that has more of a flat look to it, but on the plus side of that one, you can have a toggle feature of turning it all off as you please. So um, without further ado, I'm going to just get right into it. So right now I'm in Photoshop. If you don't have Photoshop, you can download a free program called GIMP, which allows you to do the exact same thing I'm about to do now. And keep in mind, the whole purpose of using this program now is just to alter Steve to a skin of your choice. Uh, so feel free to download it and play as it is. What you're looking at now is the first skin that I showed in the video, the one that was more detailed but it didn't have the toggle feature. First things first, you gotta decide on what you want to replace Steve with. So once you do that, you're gonna place it right in by going to File Place, and then you're just gonna choose your skin. Okay, once you got it imported, just drag it straight up over Steve on the top here. Okay, now you're gonna turn this eyeball off, and you're gonna select the layer right here, and we're gonna select the diamond and then we're gonna hit shift and then that'll allow us to drag to this part over here we hit edit copy edit paste okay drag this to the top layer and put that on and that's good so next thing you want to do is you want to select this right here and then hit edit copy edit paste right now we just pasted the right arm so we're putting it right where the left arm goes and we have to select each individual side of the arm um, so this is the top of the arm right here, and we're going to flip it horizontally. Keep in mind, depending on which program you're using, GIMP, Photoshop, different versions of Photoshop, the way you flip horizontally might be a little different. So yeah, keep that in mind. Okay, so, you know, just select everything here. Okay. Once you do that, what you have to do is you got to switch this right here. So edit, copy this, edit, paste it. You're going to plop it here, turn this off, and then vice versa. All right. And that's it. Um, keep watching to see the other skin, which is the flat one that has the toggle feature. I'm going to be showing how to do that one next. Alrighty, so now we're looking at the second skin that I showed in the video. This is the one that has all the toggle features. So, um, yeah. Again, first things first, decide on which skin you're going to replace Steve with. So once you have decided on that, you're going to import it in by hitting File, Place. Then you're going to choose your skin. Did I just hit Cancel? Wow, I did. File, Place, choose your skin, hit Place. Drag it up here over Steve. And this one is a little different. We don't have to cut around anything, making things difficult, because that's this one, obviously, the base skin layer is right here. So uh, keep that on. Now with this one, we have to just copy the arms again. Edit copy. Edit paste. We're going to drag this right down here. This is the left arm, so we have to flip this every individual side of the arm horizontally. So this is the top of the arm. Image, rotate flip horizontal. Now as I've said before, depending on which program you're using, GIMP, Photoshop, or a different version of Photoshop, you may have to uh, flip horizontally. It might be done using different ways. I'm not sure. But you know, this is how you do it with my program. <clears throat> so we're just going to flip this all. If you're getting a little confused um, on how thick you should do the selection, um, each side of the arm is four pixels going across. So that, if that helps, that's how you know. Okay, now that we have it all selected, we've got to select the first uh, uh, thing here. And we're going to hit Edit Copy, Edit Paste. We're going to drag this right here to the third slot. And now we're going to turn that eyeball off. And then we're going to copy the third slot and replace it with the first slot. So this goes right here. Turn this back on, and then that's it. Oh wait, no, that's not it. What am I saying? We gotta copy the pants and do the same thing. So uh, yeah, we're gonna copy the pants. 
Edit copy, edit paste. All right, again, we're gonna select right here, image, rotate, flip horizontal. Image, rotate, flip horizontal. Okay, now again, the same thing as before. We're going to take this first slot here, copy it. And then we're going to paste it right over the third slot. And then take the third slot and paste it right over the first slot. Whoa, what am I doing? Turn this back on. And then that's it. This is all you got to do for this one. We're done. To save it, you go to File, Save As, and you could, you got to choose PNG, and then call it whatever you'd like, and that's it. This is the end of the video. I thank you all for watching. If you want to make this skin from scratch all on your own, um, you can click the link on the screen. That'll bring you to another video where um, I show you how to make this all from scratch.